yourself, you said you will provide to whosoever as in your name. John chapter 14, verse 13 says it clearly. And whatever you ask in my name, that I will do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. 14 says, if you ask anything in my name, I will do it. Oh God, I have always fasted. I have been praying and I know you will do for me something today, this day. Thank you for whosoever you are, for what mighty things you do, oh God. Who has defeated me in fasting, oh God? Who has defeated me in praying? Please provide for me a joy. I have prayed, I have fasted. Yes, brother. Oh, nice to see you, brother Fred. Yes, you, brother. Yes, brother. you are up. Okay, you. Oh, you know, sometimes work takes oh. us up and then you know we have to come back and look for God as well. But I have got an opportunity for you. Mm, what is that opportunity? Yeah, there's this company which is looking for a marketing director. And I remember you told me you started marketing. Mm. Ah, you know, I did marketing. Oh, oh, yes. That's so good. And uh, yeah, I was sharing with one of my friends and they told me about this new company mm -hmm. which I've just opened. Mm -hmm. The one they are looking for that marketing manager. Mm. Uh, it's for Indian. Ah, yes. And I'm getting some good money on it. No, 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 no. Brother Fred, no, no way. Fred, don't you know that when I, the first job I had, I was working for Indian. Then I can't work for Indians anymore. Indians, first of all, they are these people who love money. Those people, they love to work. 24-7, they're always at work. You know, one day when I was at work, I even told you the story. I was at work and reading the Holy Book of God. This Indian manager came from nowhere. He threw away my, my, my Bible. Can you believe? I can't work for those Indians. Those Indians, first of all, they don't know God. They worship these different gods around and they love money. This is the opportunity you have to share to them. You know, they don't have to evangelize and let them to know the good you're serving. And, and you're throwing this opportunity? No, 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 no. Brother Fred, I can't associate myself with people who don't know God. I, they are going to make me to leave my God. No, 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 brother. Let me even put back down my Bible. Brother Fred, if it is for that, I am not going to work for any Indian. No, 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 whatsoever. No way, no way. I love my God. I worship him. I fast for him. I can't allow anything. Brother, to let me tell you this. You need to understand the thing. Because God was so clear when He said He will bless the work of your hands. And if you're not working, how can He bless you? He has blessed you with this opportunity here. And no, this is a great opportunity for you to change the world around, to turn these people. And you're throwing it away. How long are you going to be at church calling for people for you know, tips and money to take you back home? You, you, you're called to be a blessing. Faith without, without actions is dead. It's a dead one. So if you believe in God to bless you and you're not working, what if I go there and these people mislead me? I can't even get time to pray. I can't get time to fast. I can't get any single time with my God. Go and ask God, is this the opportunity I have to pray for your glory to come? Yes, that's the thing you have to do. My brother, wake up. This stuff means you have to go and share the word to them and you bring them closer to the Lord. You're serving the true God. And if you don't do that, mind you, you're going to stay in that state. Okay. My brother, I like me with you, but don't throw this chance away because it's what God has given you to come and share with you. So think about it and then uh, act accordingly. Actually, brother friend. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hey, brother friend. I'm saying a transport. 